the city. As Don mentioned, we are financially strong. We still have work to do. And a lot of that is credited to a collective effort of all the council members. The job is getting done. People like living in La Quinta. We have survived the recession, but we have a lot of challenges ahead of us. We have insurance challenges, prevailing wage challenges. We've got purse challenges with benefits. And there's a lot of things that are coming down the pipe that require a thought outside the box. And I'm running for mayor this time. For me, it's go big or go home. If I don't win, I'm off the council and I no longer serve the residents of La Quinta. With that, I believe that we need new leadership and new energy to carry us forward. Again, the job's been getting done and I'm proud to serve with Terry, Christy, Lee, and Dawn. But now we need to look to the future and we need to look towards what needs to happen to generate more economic growth in our city. We need to look at the regulations that have been in place for a long time loosen things up a little bit and make it more business friendly. We need to address things like the salt and sea and the renewable energy options to produce things that would be valuable to our community. I'm in the healthcare business. I will continue to be there in my full-time job at JFK, but I also have a passion for health and wellness. The salt and sea is a big deal. And if we don't collectively address that, it's gonna be a big problem for us. I serve on the Energy Environmental Commission. I help support the initiative for the salt and sea restoration and it's now time to take the lead with other federal and state agencies to do something about that. We also need to develop Silver Rock. Silver Rock is a revenue generator. There's lots of wonderful things that are, that are planned for that destination. We have another study session tomorrow at City Council at 4 to address that. And another thing we're addressing tomorrow is storm drains. Looking at what we can do to prevent the other 700,000 year flood, whatever you want to call it, we need to look and think, if this is now the new norm, how do we get there? Okay, so those are some of the real problems and challenges that are ahead of us. I've got the energy to serve this community. I love La Quinta. It's an exciting opportunity for some challenges and yet growth and preserve everything we know and love because I want to retire here just like many of you are and you are the foundation of what makes La Quinta tick. We've got to do things with 111 Corridor and Old Town La Quinta, and I look forward to talking to you more about those as the questions come up. Thank you.